Good afternoon. Today's April 4th. Um, I just wanted to say that I believe that we're going to be leaving here anytime. Um, I don't believe we have much longer. Other people are saying the same thing that I've been paying attention to. Uh, they've been saying they believe it's going to happen before May. You know, in the month of May. I don't know about all that, but, you know, I mean, they're saying, they're trying to say they believe the month, but I don't know about, yeah, I just know that it's at hand. I do know that. It could happen right now, you know what I mean? But uh, I took this photo in 1977. You see that little spirit above my head? You can see a little trumpet being blown right there. That's what that is. I took it in 77. I didn't see this photo until 2014. I was 17 years old when I took this photo in 77. Okay? And I didn't see this photo until 2014. There's a reason why. I've been warning people for the past couple years now. Uh, ever since I got this photo. And... Uh, I mean, everything, my business went down the tubes. I had a lot of people telling me I needed to speak less about this. They didn't want to hear, they didn't want me warning nobody. I was offered jobs at the Tampa Bay Stadium, making 60 grand a year. But if you paid attention to see what kind of games they were having, halftime shows and stuff, it's pretty evil and demonic going on today. Uh, this world we live in is, it's very evil. You know, it's very evil. We've been led by the devil from the very beginning. Our parents have been led by the devil from the very beginning in this worldliness. That's what the Holy Bible was all about, it warning us about this worldliness. And what I've been trying to do is warn people to tell people this is the time to come up out of it. You know, don't be doing what everybody's doing. If you notice everything going faster and faster and faster, that's because the devil knows his time is at hand. Remember I've showed that vision about me seeing the raptures at hand? Well, the devil also knows his time's at hand. He knows that. Especially when you can be sure the devil has seen this just like you've seen it. I guarantee you he knows it. They've been around me. Actually, they're closer to me around me than most people. That's why you don't see a whole bunch of people sitting around me in my vehicle. You don't see people calling me, offering me jobs, helping me out like that, you know. I've got a couple of people that help me out. And uh, I'm not gonna even get into saying who all that is because number one, um, I've had a lot of shit coming from the devil, evil. I've seen people getting hosted by these demons, too. Jumping in them like they're a puppet. You know, people have been showing where people walking down the street butt naked, doing real strange stuff. And then they can't account for how it happened. They weren't on drugs or nothing. And that's because these demons can jump in you and host you like a puppet. Very fast, too. I've showed pictures of it. Uh... I've had a couple of people that have helped me, you know, financially a little bit through this. And I've always tried to get a little bit of work. But like I said, um, the devil's pretty much come up against me because he doesn't like me warning nobody or telling nobody what's about to happen. Um, but I'm going to tell you again, and I'm going to keep saying it. It's at hand. Two nights ago, I had a dream where uh, it looked like our government. Our government was coming against us here. And because uh, when we leave, the grace goes with us. And it's going to be evil here. This government's going to turn wicked. The Holy Spirit right now is holding back the evil. It's holding it back. That's why it can't do what it wants to do right now. But once the wise are taken out of here, the wise virgins, not the foolish, but the wise... That's when hell on earth is going to begin. And this government is going to uh, be bringing in the terrorists, anybody and everybody that's evil under the sun. Because he knows his time is short. And what it's going to be about 
is killing as many people as they can kill. They're going to want to get you to take the mark of the beast and uh, damn your soul. That's what it's about. They just want to damn your soul, take you to hell. Um, and I've been warning people. See, they don't want me to warn nobody. That's why they offer me, you know, jobs, pretty good money, you know. I mean, but it it wasn't worth it, you know what I mean? I just want to survive and get through this, which I am, you know. It's just not that comfortable. It's very uncomfortable, actually. Um, but it's far better. I believe I'm here for this reason, you know. I believe that's what I came here for. That's why the angel's above my head blowing the trumpet because he knew that I wasn't going to take the uh, money offered. Grace, you know, they say five represents the number for grace, okay? There's five letters in the word number grace. But anyhow, I'm my mother's fifth child. I was born on May 23rd. May's the fifth month. Two plus three is five. I'm 55 now. I was five years old when they started counting down the Super Bowl. We had the 50th Super Bowl this year. There's 49 yards on each side of that 50-yard line. 49 years is what they call a jubilee. And uh, Jesus said, I'm going to separate the sheep from the goats. And they're being separated now. I've had times where I'm talking to people, showing this photo. And there's other people that don't like it. And they're getting even more wicked now than ever before. They'll come in and they get mad. I've seen people slamming stuff on the counters around me. They do, they just change instantly once they see me. So I know it's at hand. We're getting ready to go. And the devil knows his time's at hand too. He knows he's got little time left. I've seen people, their lips trembling, their bodies trembling around me even. You know, because they know... Um, Yeah, their time's up. They know their time's up, and uh, they got very little time. They're not looking forward to what's coming, you know, because they know they were cast out of the heavens and must have been pretty fast and hard and furious, you know. And uh, what the Lord can do, you know, is going to be very furious. And, you know, you can't, nothing can stand up against the Lord. He's the light. You know, and anything that's in the dark, boy, when he comes in and shines his light on it, boy, they don't like that. You know, they're weak in the light. They, they Nothing can come up against the light. Um, just find, you know, be at peace. Seek the Lord Jesus Christ. Come up out of the world. Don't be worldly right now because I'm telling you, it says it in the Bible. Come out of her unless you want to suffer her wrath. You're going to be left behind, you know. Are you helping us to uh, um, save souls, you know? Are you helping to save souls? You can't do that and be worldly, you know? I walked out of my business, man. I've been living in my truck. Yeah, this is still worldly. I'm living in a truck. I can't help it. It's the only place I got. You know, and it gives me shelter when it rains or it's a place for me to lay down. You know, and it's just temporary, you know. I'm looking to be out of here. I'm tired of it. When I saw I needed help with some work or something, you know, um, you know, there's not much time left, but I need to be working too. Yeah, but either way, um, I've had a little bit of help out there too, and I'm not even going to say how or who or, because like I said, it's, the devil's come up against me enough to where um, I wouldn't want the devil to even come around those that have helped me, you know. It's not a good thing, you know. <clears throat> but anyhow, it's at hand. Get ready. We don't have much more time. I'm looking forward to this being finished because I'm, I'm very tired. But I know it's at hand, and a lot of other people are saying that too. It's real close to happening. Um, it's just very tiresome, man. I'm ready to go, man. I'm very tired. God bless you. Remember this power in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. And uh, we're about out of here. We're ready to go home, man. Be seeking him. Come up out of this worldliness now. Don't be chasing after this because this stuff's about to be destroyed. You know, I know what I've seen in my visions. It's finished here, okay? 
God bless you and be with the Holy Spirit.